tens of thousands of tests uh, a little over a month ago to well over five and a half million today. We are still low in our testing capacity compared to where we should be. But Chelsea Boyd, an epidemiologist and research fellow at the nonpartisan R Street Institute, says there's still much work to be done. And a lot of the governors, when they speak, they're talking about how they're having a hard time procuring tests. Jouas says the blueprint state-by-state approach will allow the federal government to successfully ship testing resources where they're needed. And I have very confidence, every confidence, that working together in the kind of partnership we envision, that the states will be able to obtain their goals. Jouas says the White House plans to reevaluate the blueprint after May and June. In Washington, Trevor Shirley, News 13.